Welcome to Fanfare Social Media. Today's demo is about our other features outside of the composing content and the automation features. When you first log in, you're right in our compose area, but let's take a look at some of our other features. Uh, in your inbox, you're going to see uh, any priority messages that you may want to reply to or do something with. Uh, for example, when you've uh, followed somebody, they may thank you for that, and you may want to engage them. Here's a person we've had some ongoing uh, conversations with, and we could send back uh, a reply to them. Also, in our uh, inbox, you can set up any of your streams. So rather than logging into those accounts directly, we can set up a, a Twitter feed. Uh, or for fa Facebook or LinkedIn or whatever uh, streams that you want to set up. You can filter these uh, however you want by newest or um, any other variety of ways of filtering. Uh, in our tasks area, we don't have any set up right now, but literally from our inbox, just review that one more quick, from our inbox, we could pick a particular message and assign a task for someone to follow up on that if you had a colleague that was helping with you. And that would show in tasks and also kick off an email to them. That's a nice feature. Monitoring, uh, we've talked about it in a couple other demo modules, very powerful. Here you can see uh, what's being said about your brand out on the social networks and blogs. We even track it by uh, type of sentiment, uh, negative, positive, and where you're mentioned over time. You can filter these by all kinds of different selections, only for the negative. Uh, sentiment and engage people in that way um, or just on the blogs etc and so you may want to pick out some of these and uh, respond to them or again you can use the automation feature and assign it to someone scheduled uh, currently we don't have any scheduled quiz because we are heavy users of our auto campaigns and those only show uh, messages are scheduled on the day that they're ready to go out. So we'll have some here uh, tomorrow. Uh, I'm doing this a little bit later in the afternoon. You can have your drafts all, all ready for you to see and review and make changes to. Uh, nice, A couple of nice features here uh, just for managing your activity. You can see what's sent. When something goes out, uh, in this case it's just a, a thank you on a Twitter, Twitter follower, or uh, here's an RSS feed or somebody uh, that we're uh, sending a, a post to on our Facebook fan page. Here it'll show uh, the, the post that was going out. A great feature is in the bounced area. If something does not go out, you're going to get alerted two ways. You'll get an email, but also it'll show in here and give you a little message that uh, explains what the error is. Then you can correct uh, whatever that error is, click on it, uh, make the adjustment, and resend it again. Calendar is going to show uh, by a variety of types of messages, the ones that are scheduled, sent, or various tasks that are assigned if you're, uh, if you're a manager and you want to look at that. Uh, the calendar will show what's going on at any given point in time. Uh, again, we don't have anything scheduled here yet because our stuff is scheduled to go out tomorrow. So once tomorrow comes, it'll hit our schedule. But the calendar is great for seeing what's going on and only have to worry about it a day at a time with our features. Uh, if you use some of the other automation features where you schedule things multiple days in advance uh, and you do it too much, it can be really time consuming to try to make adjustments. And the feeds is, in this case, our internal feeds for industry uh, hotspots that we're looking for that we track. Uh, and you can add more. Of course, you can also set these up to go out to your social networks. And then um, our training guide, which you saw a peek uh, at a couple of times here, is a great little on online tutorial, very nicely done. It allows you to go frame by frame from getting started all the way through. Uh, you can go page by page. It'll give you screenshots and show you information and explain the key things to you about how to get going. Or you can go to a particular area uh, and 
focus on that if you're trying to do something special at the moment. Uh, just really nicely done and very uh, thorough as well. So you can skip around, go page at a time. Uh, if you went page at a time, it'll take you right through each of these. In the reports area, of course, you can see an overview of the reports. I go into the specific type of reports uh, again and see what you want uh, that you're looking for exactly. So that's our quick overview for today of all of our other features uh, beyond just composing. These are more of the social management features. Hope you enjoyed it and have a great day. And here's the way to contact us today. For any questions, please contact Tom Griffin by phone at 770-631-9537, email at tom.griffin at fanfaresocialmedia.com. Please like us on Facebook at slash fanfaresm, or follow us on Twitter at slash fanfaresm, and visit our blog at fanfaresocialmedia.wordpress.com. We hope to hear from you soon.